There's just three games in the cave this Saturday night, but we got a ton of goals. Let's check it out. My name is Andreas Sachinke, and you're watching Dell THL Update. We take it to Balashika, Moscow region first, where a rivalry game takes place. Avangard meets Sevier. It starts with bad news for both sides. Evgeny Chesalin gets 5 in a game for Nin, Sergei Kalchinsky, who did not return to action after the collision. Man and White get on the board in a 4 and 4 situation. Savala Tokshenko scores from the slot, and that's his first goal of the year. The Hawks get back even early in the second. Dayo Yakupov converts in a power play as it tips the puck past Harry Saturday. A few minutes later, Ivan Telegian puts Avangard in the lead as it puts the puck on net from the right wing, and somehow it goes in. They improved their lead to 3 1, muted to the frame. Dayo Yakupov scores his second power play goal of the night, while Oliver Kosky draws another assist. Sibir swaps Saturday for Anton Krasotkin after that and get a goal back before the intermission. Dennis Golubev hits the back of the net with a shot from midpoint. And right after that, Slava Litovchenko makes Shimon Grubitz pay for a clumsy defensive play. Litovchenko celebrates his second of the night and it's a 3 3 tie after 40. Avangard give up a two goal lead, but they still get a W with a late marker. Ivan Telegin gets his lumber on Billy Pocker shot and scores his second of the night as well. Telegin and Yakupov get two talents for Avangard each, and they beat Sibir 4 3 on home ice. Moving on to Cherepovets, where Severstal do battle with Nafti Kimek. Buckle up, because this one is proper wild. The host break the ice just over a minute in. Vladislav Kadala skates in over the blue line, takes a shot and beats Yaroslav Fazolin. Two minutes later, Janis Natinen gets it past the rookie netminder to extend the lead to 2 0. Shortly after that, Igor Giraski makes a wonderful pass to Nikita Makayev, and the defenseman wires it home to force Nefzikimik to swap the netminders. The Wolves get on the board 17 seconds into the following period. Marat Hyrolan takes a muffin of a shot, but it falls Dmitry Shugayev. Vladislav Kadola restores his three goal margin with his second of the night, which comes on a power play. And right before the intermission, Giannis Nyatin and nets his second of the game as well to improve the lead to 5 1. Game over, right? Not so fast, Lukas Klok converts on the man advantage really early in the third to give Nefzikimek a ray of hope. With less than seven minutes remaining on the clock, Ronald Knott hits the target of a cross-ice pass. With less than three minutes to go, Yevgeny Mitakin powers his way to the net and scores an absolutely gorgeous goal. It's 5-4 now. And they complete the comeback just 30 seconds later. Marat Kairoulin scores his second of the night and tenth of the season. The game goes to overtime and Severstal clinches the extra point. Adam Lishka spoils it for Neftekimik with a mid-range shot. Severstal wins this bomb burn at 6-5 on home ice. Our final game of the night takes place in Podolsk, Moscow region, Dynamo Riga Challenge Vidas. The two are direct competition to each other, and it shows. Hunter Shinkerik opens up the score in just under three minutes in with a power play goal. They make it a 2 0 hockey game with yet another marker on a man advantage. Yari Karyolainen finds the back of the net. Vidas responds with a power play goal of the own late in the period. Nika Oyamaki scores his 13th of the season. The host even it up muted for the second. Valtteri Kamilainen takes a shot from midpoint and it goes straight in. Late in the period, Miro Altenen completes this beautiful pass by Nika Oyamaki to put Vitas in the lead. But with just seven seconds remaining to play in the period, Kristoff Sotnik scores his first goal of the year to tie it up at threes. He goes to overtime and Hunter Shinkarik gets to be the hero. He scores his second of the night and this one is for the win. Dynamo enjoys their third straight victory. 4-3 is your final. And that's it for the LKHL update, but do come back tomorrow for another set of six games including Salamatilayev against Metalurg and Tractor vs Dynamo Moscow. 
My name is Andreas Sashinka. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you again soon.